Presented by Tap Room. 74 Wyndham Street. The ultimate sporting hub. www.drinkfromthetap.co.nz F-F-N-F-N You crazy for this one, Rick? The Tap Room presents Sprawl and Brawl. The ultimate comeback podcast. 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 With Dan, JB, and Eddie Redscarp. <laughs> All right, another weekend of Sprawl and Brawl. I forgot to turn my microphone on. I'm fucking stupid <laughs> as hell. It's Dan here. JB, the ultimate writer. Hey, yo, what's up? You notice how I'm emphasizing the T in writer? I, I like that. I like because that. Because last I'll time you called him it the to writer. Me to That's right, and I've been calling him the ultimate writer, and he's been having all sorts of biker dudes turning up at his house. <laughs> <That's it. laughs> you know, yeah. ready, ready to get like... No, they're wearing leather for other reasons. The guys with the big moustaches as well. Yeah, yeah, yeah and the cowboy hats. <laughs> wearing, the, wearing the arseless chaps. The arseless chaps. That's yeah. the one, that's the one. Change uh, your fucking life, man. Nate. <laughs> Nate, the white guy, is joining us today. Nate, you're becoming a UFC fan more and more every week, aren't you? I am. I'm slowly learning people's names so I can follow them. Nice. I always enjoy watching. Now I can be like, oh, I know that guy. I've seen him fight. And we like it because you sound different to all of us, and we appreciate that. Red Scarf, what is up with you this week? Uh, another much man just chilling, enjoying my bourbon on this nice Sunday morning. Ah, uh, bourbon's Going on. down really good, yeah. And of course, our special guest this week, it is the last style bender, Israel Adesanya. Welcome in, brother. Welcome in. How are you, man? Well, how are you guys? Awesome, awesome, awesome. Easy. There you go. No, we want to get you nice and we, we want people to hear you, but you oh, know why? My bad, my bad. We want people to hear you because right now, you are quite possibly the baddest man in this country. Me? Hands no. down. You, oh, are, you are fucking God. people up left, right, and center. It's for money, though. It's for fun. I enjoy it. And that's what we love. <laughs> we, we love that you enjoy hurting people. No, yep. Not like that. You know, nah, it's, nah. Just, <laughs> it's just part of the game. We sign up for the deal, you know? It's how it is. Hey, you, you've just come back you from... You sound like a bully. Me. <laughs> <laughs> you sound like, just like a bully. That's what everyone thinks. That's though, good. But I'm the opposite. <laughs> Swear. I'm a bitch in these streets. <laughs> <laughs> Don't catch me on the streets, only in the ring. <laughs> but a freak in the sheets. <laughs> <laughs> so, so as you've just come back from uh, from Aussie, um, tell us, break it, break it down a little bit about, about what, what you've been up to in the last uh, 14 last days. Week. Yeah, um... Went to Australia for the 50th uh, News of Fury show. Yeah, yeah. Um, Ethan Shep, shout out to him. And yeah, he put on a great show. He put me and um, the News of Fury 8-man winner, uh, Kim Lo Don, in the, in the main event. Legend. And yeah, it was... Um, yeah, I like that guy's style, man. He pretty much just travels all around the world. Doesn't even have a coach or anything. Just goes anywhere nice. and yeah. fights. Just He's like, like you? Yeah, oh, pretty much. Yeah. Exactly. <laughs> like a badass, man. So I respect that. But And also when we're like doing the whole radio thing and whatever before the fight media I, tour yeah, exactly stuff. I realized he was a nice guy but I couldn't give him nothing so I had to just ice yeah, him out yeah. you know what I mean and the fight came to it and yeah it happened just like I said I just felt it was too slow he was predictable his um I just like these guys are too caught up in that Thai style now like yeah, they just want to be because he said he'd been training in Thailand and you, if you see his um, pre-fight video as well he said he everyone said it they've got the number they've got the magic ticket to, yeah, to, yeah. to book my ass but yeah yeah, but I don't know about basic exactly. like rudimentary Muay Thai really exactly. being. Yeah, you know. it's just too. It's it, it's the rhythm's too. Um, it's it's changed. The game's changing. Yeah. You got You got you got You got to adapt to it. If not, you yeah. get left Especially behind. if you're training Muay Thai in yeah. Thailand, you exactly. know, like, yeah. That, yeah. That, that is they don't like, let the UFC or any MMA. Yeah blow up in their country because exactly. they don't want it to take away from yeah. their sport the heavy that's nothing, tradition. That, yeah that's nothing wrong with that you know they got to keep the tradition in the yeah. country but you know it's um the game's changing you have to evolve like even he couldn't bridge Absolutely. distance with me so i had to keep him at bay and yeah, yeah i was able to just outwork him outspeed him yeah it was fun i enjoyed it though nice yeah what was your highlight of being over there last weekend last weekend ah uh, was the highlight the heat fuck on saturday like it was 41 yeah so I God stayed damn. indoors I didn't go South outside South Australia at all. Yeah. 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 Oh, yeah I stayed indoors man like Eugene said yeah no lot outside so I gotta listen to coach <laughs> and I'm just else? gonna ask you a question here do you know Carmichael Carmichael Hunt Carmichael <laughs> Hunt no. Okay, it's good that you don't know. <laughs> Why, you, do you, pass know? The, you pass the drug do test. I need to know. <laughs> <laughs> you know. He's the NRL player that. Um, oh, the, the guy that, that likes Coco, Coco as well. Yeah, yeah. 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 He he's loves in Coco. love with the Coco. <laughs> you sang the wrong song there. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know where you were going that song. <laughs> I remixed my shit. Right? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Now I only saw a meme about him. That's how I knew of all of him. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. And the last one before that wasn't it? That guy the. Gnarly Carney, where he like pissed in his mouth. Yes, that's yeah. right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> Other guys. Who the fuck, honestly, pisses in their mouth for Big a joke? Rose. That's like his Big party Rose trick. does. Yeah. Uh, actually, we that's knew a guy at a bar that actually drank his own piss. A, a pint yeah, of his piss. 
Machita no, no, style. No, no. Oh yeah, Machita did that as well. Get yeah, that yeah, nutrition yeah. reuptake in the morning. That margarita. That's that <laughs> fucked up Brazilian who's, training, eh? Who's that guy? That, who's who's that Mexican um, that uh, Floyd Mayweather um, fought? And they did margarita. in the in, in uh, I think it was it. Was yeah. it margarita? But in the yeah. Showtime build up, they, he's like going to his training gym and he's pissing into a cup and then drinking it and then they play it back for Floyd Mayweather and Bro, he's always like, like, damn, <laughs> <laughs> that's fucked up. <laughs> <laughs> nah, yeah, no, that's some crazy shit. So, um, the heat last week. Yeah, how, how the fu- I mean, how do you fight? How do you feel after the fight? Fight. I felt great, man. I didn't even like after the fight. Um, I felt like I did worse. To, I gave myself like a three or four after yeah, I yeah. came out. Yeah, of yeah. I saw that you but were then, a bit scathing yeah, on yourself. Yeah. But then I watched the tape and I saw like, okay, some things I actually worked on. Yeah, and I wanted to execute. I did. So I, I put it up to a five. But if my mom called me, I was just like. Yeah, you were about a five. You weren't really. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Up. They, they critique Mum, you. Mum's well. no. She's yeah. Yeah, mums she's no. Mum's no. Yeah, yeah, they have no yeah. reason That's to miss around. That's not my boy. Though. My boy wouldn't. That, he, he doesn't do. He performs better than that. <laughs> yeah. She, yeah, she put me up to a, to a high standard, so I have to, I have to live up to it. My mum listens to me on this, and she's like, you are the worst of the lot. <laughs> <laughs> she says, but I love that Nate, that, the white guy. He's, yeah, he's good. <laughs> he's, he's a lovely voice. Nice, nice. tone. Talks like this. <laughs> But yeah, I mean, uh, the the game itself was it was a good game, but I just felt like uh, some things I could have worked on yeah. and um, executed better. Like when well, I was throwing my two, my right hand, he kept on ducking towards it, so I started following his head, and that's just something I should. Instead have of done. throwing a yeah. different counter, yeah, exactly. You're right. You know, there's, there's always options, but yeah, I just went for the same thing over. But I finished him with elbows. And yeah, yeah, it was, that was fun. You watch a lot of tape? Me? No, I only saw one of him. Just with six um, tapes? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I think he makes a star in them. <laughs> one. Uh, that one. They're short films, actually. Vines? Uh, <laughs> <laughs> just vines? <laughs> <laughs> that one pump chump. <laughs> no, so, but, like, you, you don't watch a lot of tape? Of, no, I of saw the one of him and Jamie is. It was like a little yeah. highlight. And yeah. he dropped Jamie like three times, and Jamie dropped him, and then he finally stopped him with like a yeah. standing eight count. And yeah, that looked like a good fight, but I didn't see the whole fight. Yeah, yeah, Eugene, yeah. my coach, is the one that watches all the tape. Excuse me. And he's the guy that um, kind of just puts a game plan together. But for yeah, me, nice. I don't really have a game plan. I just, I know I'm going to go fight the best version of this guy. So I yeah, go yeah. in there and I know he could do anything. He could fucking pull out a tornado kick and I yeah. don't see it coming. So I just go in there to adapt and overcome. Like if you don't limit your, your own sort of exactly. game plan, then you've got the potential to hit there everything. We go. Exactly. I don't yeah. limit myself. Yeah. Some guys say, think... A lot of guys <laughs> wait till MMA comes around. They're gonna think, "Oh, I'm gonna take this guy down." Yeah, yeah. And then yeah, they're gonna yeah. be in for a shock as yeah. well, you know. So they they limit themselves with that thinking already. Yeah. So I don't like to limit myself at all. Nice, nice. And what you know, what do you got coming up? Have, have yeah. you uh, had, had any calls from right. Glory yet? Yeah, Super Glory. Right. Now nah, we'll hit them up. Like I said, um, last time they hit me up was in October, but yeah. Uh, I mean, allegedly, or how do I not say this? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> I don't want to get in trouble, but like, uh, I just felt like, uh, like after King of the Ring and all these other things, like my pay went up, and yeah. I was signed to a certain amount uh, to right. fight with them. So I just felt like I already, and they were taking too long as well. So I was sure. already contracted to fight in Brisbane yeah. for the WBC title, and they were paying yeah. way nice. more. So I was like, mm, nice. I'm gonna go with these guys instead. Well, you got to make that paper while that Bro, window that is open, yeah, yeah. you know. For like, about the money. Yeah. Yeah. Well, you got the Super 8 coming up. Yeah, it's man. down at Christchurch, eh? Christchurch, yeah. church. I haven't been back in like 13 years, 14 years. Sure. Wow. Yeah. Nice. So yeah, it'll be nice. Sort of yeah. a homecoming for you in, in, of yeah. sorts? Yeah. yeah. I'll just, you know, see the South Island. Yeah. I don't know. I don't know yeah. anyone there, but yeah. see what's up. I, I can't, I'm, I'm really excited to see you and just the the revenge that, I, that I'm anticipating that yeah. you're just going <laughs> to yeah. bring down, you know? Yeah. Um, I'd love like, it to be me, me and Amon in the final. I'd love yeah. it to be. Like, that would be, yeah. that would be a great story because you, you feel you mean? sort of let, let the last one sort of slip yeah, away from you exactly. and you, you had control for sure so exactly yeah. like the first round i said like i i made him do the chicken dance southpaw yeah you know, i yeah. hit him with the hook like he was throwing one as well but mike got there first yeah yeah because you know, i'm fast <laughs> yeah. I mean, yeah and then I, I that was the first round i heard him twice i even hit him to the body against southpaw yeah and we just didn't jump on it we just played it smart but um this time it's just we smell blood we go for the kill nice you know? yeah do you think there's extra pressure just because you're like you're you're viewed as a as a kickboxer and you you truly are a mixed martial artist? Yeah. Um, because you're coming into the realm of boxing, do you find that you have to perform much more to the standard that, that everyone else is performing? Yeah. Like for me, when I go in there, I didn't realize this at the time. I was kind of naive, so that's on my part. But I should have realized I wasn't just fighting the fighter; I was fighting the judges. The I was judges, yeah. The, the yeah. old, yeah, the establishment, yeah. the old yeah, boxing yeah. community. Because, yeah. you know, I mean, we're, the streets is talking. Words gets back to me. There was you know? a lot of hate, you exactly. know, when, when, yeah, you, when yeah. you were nominated. Exactly. For sure. This guy with no 
fucking amateur record, no yeah. pro fights, comes in there and whoops all their guys, and yeah. it's not yeah. going to look yeah. good for them. But wait till fucking March 28th. It'll happen. Yeah. I'll make and, sure this uh, time. I'll so make March sure. 28th in Christchurch is yeah. going to be a big one? Exactly. Nice. nice. Now, I just want to go in there and just work, man, because I feel... Like think you just know when you know something, everything it's like a perfect storm. It's coming together nicely, so I like it. And then two yeah. weeks after King in the Ring, so I'm just yeah, this is gonna be the camp of camps. Is there anyone in particular that you're? Because yeah. I I don't think that you're scared of anyone. Yeah. But is there yeah. anyone that you wouldn't? I worry about. You worry about. Who do I know so far that's in the lineup? None of the I, I, the ones for, I know so far, none of them scare me. None of them worry nice. me. Yeah. It's like it's just. I mean, at the end of the day, I'm finding another man. You know. Yeah, yeah. Like, if I cut him, he'll bleed. Yeah, yeah. You know, exactly. So I just know. Hopefully, you don't cut him for real with a knife. Prison style. Yes, yes, yes. Everyone <laughs> be like, uh, "What the fuck just happened?" <laughs> this is why we don't get this motherfucker <laughs> on the show. <laughs> and what what the am hell? I stabbing? <laughs> like, so, like um, referee stoppage. Yeah. From yeah. That's why. Nah, so, but um, um, yeah, I just. I, I don't, none of them they none of them pose a threat to me like they yeah. just they're high level guys and I respect them for what they do but yeah it's just I just know you know what I can do when I get in there and I put the yeah, work that's in right. you know what I mean awesome well let's move move along on to a topic that's been pretty big in the world of MMA and the oh, UFC oh no come on <laughs> yeah, um, not the Mexican supplements well yeah <laughs> absolutely you know um, yep. obviously recently there's been a lot of a lot of fighters are uh, not being able to piss straight so it seems uh, you know, <laughs> not, not getting all their ducks in a row and um, <laughs> yeah, 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 right. yeah, yeah. it seems to be big news in a lot of sports but yeah. um, the UFC they had a press conference on Thursday in New Zealand time and they um, you know they've advocated for much tougher penalties for those that are caught and they've also they're also going to begin mandatory testing for all fighters out of competition from July the 1st nice that's so, yeah. a lot of money man I'm hearing yeah. like it costs about 30 to 50 grand for each test yep Wow, that's right. that's, I think that's for for two fighters. So per fight, thirty yeah. grand. You know, Fuck. and even if that's a, a um, sort of a small estimate, yeah. that's going to be huge. Yeah. But then, you, I mean, the UFC makes a shitload of money. Yeah. yeah. So that's they're right. acting like, oh my god, but yeah. really they're like yeah. thirty thousand. Yeah. 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 We pay the ring bills more. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. That's right. And yeah, so you know, it's one thing to sort of advocate for tougher penalties, mm. but it's another Nothing thing to, to, it. to actually do something about it. Can the UFC not just enforce the penalty they could just be like yeah, you, absolutely. you don't fight for two years yeah it's like you, yeah, yeah. if you're a contracted fighter and you get busted the UFC could say cool your next fighter's in 2018 yeah yeah, yeah but that hurts the UFC it more does, than yeah. it does if it's your big stars fans, it, you know? it sucks yeah. like a guy like John Jones if they had done that for him wow. yeah. big yeah, loss for yeah. the company yeah, yeah. So it's a lot of money down the drain for them yeah. if they get rid of their big guys then it's yeah. like it's, yeah. it's kind of a toss up of your legitimacy of your sport versus you still got to make money yeah. Yeah. yeah but even like when they talk about all these okay let me see last year the UFC had a problem a real big problem with fighters getting injured Yes. Yeah. This year, so far, it's not the case. Now it's guys pissing Different hot. type of yeah. problem. Yeah. 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 yeah, You know what I mean? But each one, I feel like it's not just a black and white issue. It's, no. There's a gray area. Like John it Jones, uh, he got caught by accident because that yeah. wasn't something that was it's supposed to be testing for. not what they meant to test for. That's you right. know what I mean? Anderson, that one, I just, for me, because I'm a fanboy, so I, I want to try to yeah. speak as objective, objectively as yes. I can on Anderson. It's like, I just don't think he'd do it for the gains. I think yeah. it was something to do with the leg. Recovery, yeah. But, you know, yeah. if you look yeah. at him physically, it certainly didn't appear yeah. that it was for the gains. Exactly. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, a guy like Hector Lombard, you look at him and you know. Wow. You know, he, he failed. Yeah. <laughs> like, <laughs> the, why did, yeah, the Broke fact that, that they, had to, a, they <laughs> had to have a test. Yeah. Um, I was so shocked when he was like, <laughs> I was like, what? Yeah, just do the eye <laughs> test. Hector, no. <laughs> <laughs> Say it ain't so. Hector Lombardo. Yeah, yeah. Say it like that, that sounds test. Yeah, possibly. Well, you know, the guy's from Cuba, so. Uh, yeah, there happened. you go. You guys uh, say with like the silver thing, how if he was using it for recovery, mm. it's like is that still a bad thing? Because yeah, if you're getting back from injuries quicker, yeah. is that dodgy? Yeah, yeah. but he, he's I agree. flat out denied it. Like yeah. he said he yeah, that's, yeah that's his problem. He's playing the whole. I know yeah. I'm a you know, the, good man. <laughs> the particular yeah, the drug man. that he was done for can only be administered from my research via intravenous, so via a needle. What? Oh, for so, it via yeah. his. Ain't <laughs> <laughs> like, what the fuck? Yeah. There are drugs like yeah. that. And then, on, on, <laughs> and then on the John Jones thing, I don't think cocaine's much of a like. If he went out and fought on cocaine, probably wouldn't do too yeah. great. Yeah, yeah, Tyson yeah. did. And yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Tyson well, actually won his uh, first belt, and he had chlamydia. Yeah. Wow. Yeah. Yeah. Maybe it does help. Secret <laughs> to <laughs> success. <laughs> yeah, yeah. If I start doing cocaine, I could be in the UFC. <laughs> yeah, no, 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 no. <laughs> I mean, yeah, but like you said, for the legitimacy of the sport and for yeah, the look of the sport, it has to get clean. But at the moment it's just um, like because who's been saying it for so long guys like Luke Rockhold 
um, uh, Bisping, you know, Bisping uh, Brian yeah. Solomon. Like it's like it's yeah. a big problem yeah. in the game. Like Joe Rogan. I mean, that's why GSP left, though. Yeah. yeah, that's right. And you know, a lot of people are talking about GSP saying, "Did he leave in the nick of time?" You know, yeah. Yeah. was he like people have called him the poster boy for growth hormone? And, uh, yeah. It could be the yeah. whole thing, like with baseball, where you've got all these guys that have these amazing records and yeah. world famous, and then two or three years down the track they could be like yeah I was on roids and yeah. Yeah, you put yeah, a little yeah. asterisk next to yeah. name like yeah. they're doing that's like baseball. Uh, Lance Armstrong hey? yeah. Yeah, how he right. all those and A-Rod yeah. and Barry Bonds and them now and it's if like you look at how much money Anderson earned like in the it's somewhere in the vicinity of five million dollars New Zealand Whoa. including the, yeah. the pay-per-view points oh, from the last yeah. fight yeah. is it a big deal to get busted take a year off you know mm-hmm. oh, yeah, no. when you're making that sort I'm of sure money he'll be fine yeah 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 he can go sign some autographs and he'll be good yeah that's right you know he could go and do seminars every single week and just make make as much money as he wants so yeah. you know it, it's definitely Unhappy yeah right, they, uh, as long as they don't penalize the guys that are smoking weed yeah because really they're, they're not really enhancing they're anything not <laughs> you're I not mean, gonna become a badass yeah. by smoking <laughs> weed yeah no yeah. but um yeah i mean this problem right now i think is just like a gray area or a, 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 um a downtime for the sport yeah, you know? yeah. but yeah. i think yeah. it'll, it'll come out of it and then after get the sport gets cleaner then you can start seeing these like great athletes come and show their skills again the yeah. way they're yeah. supposed to guys yeah. like McDonald you know guys like yeah, 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 right. whoever else the, the guys who McGregor's. do the hard work you've, yeah, you've exactly. really got to just hope it doesn't turn into like baseball where you're questioning yeah. every single guy that hits a yeah. home run well, and it's like, like oh he must have been on steroids yeah he had, yeah, he had yeah, a great yeah, season yeah. was he on roids yeah. Yeah. yeah why is he happy too happy <laughs> <laughs> he's high <laughs> yeah. especially in a combat yeah. sport where it's like strength yeah. is such a huge thing like baseball there's a lot of a you're lot of like hand eye coordination you're not hurting someone when you're playing baseball or riding bicycles your the strength idea is, is a lot more important. Yeah. And that, that actually brings up a, a really good question, which is, do you see anyone in the New Zealand fighting fighting scene dabbling oh, yeah. in that stuff? Now, yes, you no, know, I, I'm, I'm a big about fan. It. Yeah. Of let's talk about it. Let's talk about it. But we can talk about it. I mean, yeah. at the end yeah, of the day, I mean, this is like barbershop talk. Yeah, yeah you exactly. Know, we, we can exactly. talk. That guy that fought Sonny Bill, he looked like he was on Roy. He was on the after effects. <laughs> but he looks like he, he was, was on steroids for his asthma, bro. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Asthma is not a, a drug that... Yeah. Bro, so, but yeah, yeah. I, but, I mean, but in like the in the New Zealand fighting scene, um, well, do we... I think it's big over here. Like, I, I, I've thought about it, like some like guys who you, I you see... You could probably tell us what the testing regime over here testing. is like. Testing is... In New Zealand right now, there's not really much, you know, yeah. testing going on. You yeah. know what I mean? So guys can come in, juice to the gills, and wow. no one would know. Yeah. But, I mean... In Australia, like certain parts, you know, when yeah. I go there, you get tested blood, you know, you have to do yeah. this and do that. See, so blood as testing well. is thorough as well, yeah, you know, exactly. that's, that's yeah, yeah. real testing. In China, like certain, certain fights I have to get tested for, yeah. you know, and for the big name fights like Glory and Wonder, yeah, you yeah. have to get tested. But, yeah, in New Zealand, it's just, I don't think there's much of a... Because um, we don't have an athletic commission, no, do we? we yeah, that's Especially for kickboxing. Uh, kickboxing yeah, yeah. Don't, so there's no, there's no testing for it. But, I yeah. mean, fuck... Even my mom was telling me this the other day, she's because she was hearing all this shit, and she's telling me like, yep. the, give me the speech about like, oh, you know, make sure you don't tarnish the family name, don't do this, do that, you know, yeah, you've worked yeah. so hard, yeah, one yeah. little thing, and then they all That's gonna think, it. oh, he's already done all those things, great yeah. things, cause he was on Roy, yeah, exactly. cause he was doing yeah, it. yeah. It's like yeah, an man. Anderson Silva situation, exactly, for you. yeah, yeah, you know, yeah. question everything he's done, yeah. 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 So that's why I'm just like, nah, I don't fuck with that, and I don't even like even before, before I started taking protein shakes, I wouldn't touch anything. I was just yeah. like, I want to do this as natural as possible, yeah. but. Even coming to that, like, where's the um, the, the the line drawn? Like, there's guys who can do yeah. like you know cryogenic chamber or whatever, yeah, you know, yeah, yeah, and yeah. recover yeah. faster by going into a chamber that and like you know minus doing, doing or whatever. treatments that are, See, are you know sort of enhance your body. Those, those, yeah. those enhance your performance as well. That's exactly. So is that, but, I mean, and you know is that doing bad? ice bath, hot bath. That exactly. That, that was a big thing recovery. with recovery. Um, mm. Lance Armstrong when when he came out and said, "Yeah, I did it." Was the thing he said he used the most was blood transfusions. Mm. It's like wow. that's not a drug. It's yeah. just you're getting fresh like blood, red blood yeah, cells yeah, coming right. in. Yeah, like yeah. recovery quicker. And the thing about he's that a vampire. Well. <laughs> <laughs> that's what he was. That's, yeah. that's what he's talking about. He's yeah. a vampire. Lance. No, but think about that as well. Also, like if they had to find the cleanest athlete in that sport, yeah. they apparently had to go to like the top. Oh, yeah. Place. Down to like yeah, yeah, yeah. Because yeah. all of them were fucking. Everyone's done. Yeah, that's right. And that's the thing. I, I, I've always wondered with even like the All Blacks, like, do they get tested? Yeah. Mm. Like, uh, that's the biggest sport by far in New Zealand. It's For like, sure. are yeah, they yeah. getting tested before every match yeah. or before every like World count? Cup? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> testing kids. Yeah, I, I've, I've actually <laughs> seen some of the players like outside of the games uh, after a game. Yeah. High as, Loving high that as, Coco. High yeah. as a motherfucker. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, yeah. it happens, man. It's part of the game. That's why when a guy like John Jones, I'm just like, look, he's young. If he, I mean, Chell said it best. He's the baddest dude on the planet right now, yeah. quote unquote. 
Yeah. And he's 25. You know, he'll be at a party doing this. And yeah. That. So yeah. Someone offers him a little line. Let him do a line. Yeah. He was and in Brazil. You know, he probably did off a hook. Yeah, that's whatever. right. Yeah. yeah, 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 yeah. Traced <laughs> the timeline. He was in Brazil Reli- at the time. Yeah. So he's yeah. probably reli- reliving some some porn <laughs> sites that he's watching. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I've seen some shit on the website, and I'm gonna try that out because I'm BrazilianButts.com. <laughs> How many times in your career? Uh, h- how long have you been like fighting, fighting professionally? Professionally, I've oh. been fighting. I've, I've been fighting since two thousand and seven, but professionally, I'd say two thousand ten. Yeah. Okay. And how many times, do you, off the top of your head, do you yeah. think you've been tested? Tested five, six. Yeah, that's yeah. that's and not a lot. Fight eh? a yeah. lot. That's not I've a fought, lot. I've fought in like kickboxing like forty four fights now. Yeah. yeah. yeah that's so, so that's pretty low yeah. like ratio. Yeah, so exactly. Yeah. You know, like what are you trying to insinuate there, my friend? <laughs> yeah, where, where is this one? Oh, going? Oh, those, those 39 <laughs> fights. I did my, uh, my team. We are gathered here today to. Uh, yeah, that, that is like definitely a flaw in the system. That well, for a, yeah. right when, now, when you're getting you. you're getting paid to do this, and yeah. and you're like people yeah. are making money off it. Yeah, you should be getting tested. Like, of course, obviously it costs. Someone's paying money. for it yeah. to get yeah. done. Promoters aren't going to yeah. fuck out for that right now. Yeah, no, yeah, yeah. Shout to Ethan. I love you, Ethan. But this more like. Even when I went to Adelaide last, he couldn't get the hotel we were normally used to by the, by the yeah. beach and everything. Damn, <laughs> what a diva. I sound like a diva right now. But, it's, it's I mean, you know, promoters are have to, they, they try and save as much money as possible. Exactly. Yeah. You know? yeah, yeah, so yeah. It is a business, that's exactly. right. Exactly. Yeah. Yep. So they don't, they're not too worried about, i got to test this guy or this yeah. guy or this yeah. guy. It's all kind of based on word of mouth or the honor of the game or efficacy, yeah. you know. See, that's understandable yeah. in yeah. Australasia and Aust- smaller markets. But for in sure. UFC, you got to be tested. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, 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 yeah. 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 guys are making millions of dollars. Yeah, yeah. Like that's when it, that's when it kind of... 10, 15 grand for a test is nothing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. that's right. I think you've got to do it, like, even with the fight nights. I'm not sure what the guys make on, like, just the weekly fight nights, but... Six for six, seven for seven. Yeah, Sometimes that's like, you know, pay. show pay. money, win money. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, Depends what contract you're on. But yeah. quick question, for this Pacquiao Mayweather one, do you know what the testing is like for this one? I would right. imagine it's going to be strict. strict. Yeah. 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 I would imagine yeah. Pacquiao's camp would have made it. Uh, uh, no, sorry, Mayweather's, Mayweather's camp, camp. Mayweather's yeah, would have made it very strong. Sounds, like, uh, yeah. sounds like a good Every negotiation. Day, yeah. Like, yeah. Um, what, 60 40 split for the money? 100, Real. 100 yeah. to, money. And to yeah. Pac Man? Yeah. 40% yeah. is uh, 100 million. So yeah. yeah. So it's huge. Also, um, that. <laughs> yeah. say that again. Yeah. Yeah. Um, <laughs> we were actually playing a game before. What would Nathan do for $100 million? Uh, <laughs> yeah, yeah. Actually, <laughs> what he I would do for $10,000 is actually pretty disgusting. This is why we have an explicit rating on iTunes. Yeah. But um, yeah, like huge, huge week last week uh, in the UFC. Well, not a huge week, but a good event. Uh, great fight between Bendo and Thatch. Uh, we saw Bendo, Benson Henderson, former champion, take yeah, out man. the win in the fourth round with a rear naked choke. Definitely took Brandon Thatch into some deep water and and got the better of him. And showed, and he really showed everyone that he is a high level competitor. And no matter yeah. what, um, he had a huge class spring in his step you know? as well. You know, what like was a striking huge. light. I just missed that fight. I I didn't, I didn't get to watch it, but I have uh, to. It, w- it was the Thatch. It was the Thatch show for. The first two rounds, yeah, real, and then yeah, okay. after that, he gassed just out. Yeah, gassed no, out. Yeah, no real Fetch lighting up. In the third yeah, round, yeah, yeah. You know, it's with that altitude, yeah. fighting Bendo, who's got pace, smaller guy, having to chase him around, and the way he mm. fights as well, because that just hits the gas. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Right. That's from the UFC fights that I've seen. Yeah, yeah, yeah exactly. He, he's definitely throwing. Yeah, the whole Matt time. Brown. Fuck, there's so many good fights I'd love to see, man. That would be a huge right fight. Well, well, Matt Brown and uh, Johnny Hendricks uh, going are going to be yeah, fighting soon, right. so that'll be a good fight. Even uh, Carlos Conda and uh, Tiago Alves. 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 Oh, really? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, so shit. They're, they're looking at um, signing a That's contract a for a fight. It's a nice, uh, nice. nice kickboxing fight. Yeah, yeah. fuck yeah. Because well, uh, yeah, Alvarez won his last fight, um, yeah. and he was losing that too. Yeah, yeah. he, he was, was getting toesed up, yeah. and then out of nowhere, they uh, liver kick Jordan and Mean and just yeah, yeah, fucking destroyed him. Mean was looking mad though, man. Was, mean like was looking him. mean. I like yeah. <laughs> Same I, I like as style, in his uh, fight against Matt Brown, he was looking great up oh, until he got finished. Sure. Yeah. But yeah, he he's, he throws a lot of good shots and real different shots too. The shots that yeah. um, you can kind of see John Jones, that young kinda generation, that stepping forward and back elbow. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He's tall, so he knows how to use it well. Yeah. I like his style. What I did like about Bendo, though, was the way Bendo was moving, particularly in those first yes. rounds. Even though Thatch was sort of had the upper hand, yeah. Bendo was Bendo was controlling the pace of the yeah. fight. He looked so right. energetic, and, and yeah, he looked great. And I don't think it worried him what it, the strikes that he was taking because yeah. I think he was using those first rounds. He was able to sort of pick where he was gonna. Yeah. Because he's a, he's a, I don't care what anyone. He's one of my favorite fighters in the yeah, UFC. Definitely. I don't care what anyone. He is a very very smart, um, yes, yes. smart competitor. Yeah. 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 Obviously in the cage and out of the cage. Yeah. yeah. And and I think Thatch kind of played into his hand a little bit, and you could just see it in the. Third round, um, 
Thatcher looked really gassed. He, he slowed yeah. right down. A veteran. Yeah, well, yeah. you know. He, and, and he gave up in the fourth, it yeah. looked like, anyway. So probably just try to tire him out in the first two rounds. Because, you know, we talked about before that you don't go into a fight with a game plan. And, you know, Brandon Thatch, has, you know, he has the same game plan every fight. Get rid of them in yes. the first round. So yes. Yeah, yeah. 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 So if you don't have cardio like Cardi- um, Cain Velasquez, then you yeah. shouldn't be pushing yeah. the, the pace that, that pace. much if you yeah. can't last it all the way through. Yeah. Especially if... Because uh, people who have never there. trained on a bag or... Would throw in any punches don't, probably don't understand well, yeah you know so uh, I've I've never been now anywhere where I've really noticed the difference in the altitude you never been to the I mountains have. yeah N- the, the highest ma- the like highest mountain was Mount Albert <laughs> and that's, that's, that's more <laughs> that's more like a tiny ass there was some oxygen deprivation going <laughs> yeah. on there, I, I was still fucking that, tired that was the walk <laughs> yeah that was a, that <laughs> had nothing to do that with those thin ass <laughs> yeah but like um, have you fought anywhere with uh, I've altitude I've fought a high altitude but I've trained in, in it before in China but yeah. it's just the air is thinner and it's just I don't want to say you f- it's not like an asthma attack but if you're not used to it it will feel something like that like an asthma attack sure. and just find it hard to breathe you know they even have to warn you about it they even have to war- warn you about it when you um like they have signs in, in Denver saying you know was a vigorous exercise and advised or whatever, you know what I mean? Just because ah. people passing out. No sex yeah. in the hotel. <laughs> yeah. Um, yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> that's another, uh, that's a really another important question. Yeah. How has your pussy intake increased ah, since, <laughs> since, uh, <laughs> since winning um, <laughs> King of the Ring? Are you uh, now king of the bed? Me, uh, king of the dingling. I say <laughs> 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 oh, wow! Shit, you guys are gonna give me Wh- Where the fuck did you? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Where did you come up with that? <laughs> yeah, yeah. I know that. I know that the words rhyme, but <laughs> they're they not good together. <laughs> did you pick up? Did you did you pick that up at the parade you went to last? That's good. Yeah. You on one of the floats of last night? Just like I was there before. I was here. Yeah, they had the hero parade and fight of the night. You on queen of the night? Yeah. No. Yeah, but uh, I mean, like, do you get more girls like uh, coming up to you and being like, "Hey"? Uh, for me, it's just like I said. Right now, all I do is just focus on the game. I'm married yeah. to the game. You know, that's my bay. But yeah. even this weekend, fuck, I'll tell you a story. No names. I won't put any names out there. But Good. I cool. realized Veronica. Why. <laughs> <laughs> uh, actually, it was Shantae. But anyway, <laughs> no, but um, yeah, like I just realized why I don't, why I, I chose to, to live the way I live now. Because before the fight. Or someone, or just one of the, you know, side chicks I was seeing text something about, I'm not on a priority right now. I'm just kind of like, I'm about to fight in about three hours. Yeah, yeah. And yeah. then she got mad at me. Then I kind of realized, like, what the fuck? Yeah. I don't fuck with you. And I yeah, just deleted yeah. everything straight away. It kind of goes without saying that yeah. when you're hours away from a fight, that you don't need you know, to battle someone else. Do you think that, that motivated yeah. you yeah. a little bit? Because I'll tell you, I'll, I'll get bitches to text you before every fight. Yeah. Be like, <laughs> <laughs> no, you okay. ain't shit. No, 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 I had, no, had kind of like a deja vu moment with my, because um, like one time when I was in Adelaide as well, I fought Gary, Will, uh, Gar- is Gary Williams. Yeah, Gary Williams, my first fight with him. And it was close. You know, but it was because before that fight, I was having an argument with my ex yeah. about some bullshit. And my, I was fighting that rather than thinking about the fight. Yeah, yeah. yeah. So yeah. then when I had that moment, I was just like, what the fuck? Yeah, I yeah. I deleted yeah. everything, man. I, didn't nice. I think yeah. it's safe to say, whether you're a fighter or you're a bartender or you're a bellhop, b- when bitches be crazy, it's going to fuck your <laughs> night up. Yeah, yeah. 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 So you don't yeah. need that kind of drama in your life. Except for Nate. Let- yeah. Nate, 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 <laughs> Nate, Nate's very pi- Nate, the white guy here is very picky yeah. on who he associates to femininely. Dick yeah. Pride. Um, it's dick pride. You gotta have that. He's got, he's <laughs> <a man. laughs> no, you got his dick pride is immense. Like, <laughs> like, you get, you get chicks coming up to him everywhere. Like, you know, oh, hey, hey, pretty eyes, this, that, that, and he's just oh. like. <laughs> You gonna order a drink? Go, <laughs> <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. you know. Fedor. There's, there's no. Fedor. There's no. He's not about that business. He's about eye on the game. Yeah. yeah, he knows what's real. He knows what's what's up with everything. So, so for you, like, no six, what, three weeks, two nah, weeks, man, I'll bust month before, like the night before the fight, I can't sleep. Damn. Yeah. yeah. Like I mean, if I can't sleep, you know, just release one that you can. And that is a, so. Yeah. That, yeah. No, so no, that's I, a me- I do that before <laughs> every <laughs> podcast. <laughs> hey, well, your hands been. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. You shook you should his hands, right? <laughs> My man. My <laughs> man. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it smells like cinnamon. <laughs> 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 no, but I mean, like, um, it's okay. I don't want to say it's a myth because there's. Uh, I mean, if you if you deprive yourself, you know, you'll have. If okay, if I don't have sex, like if I don't work out, I just become a cunt. I just yeah, how right. I feel. So, so if the mental I thing is bigger than the I physical think so. drawback, I think so. Yeah, yeah, it doesn't physically doesn't affect me. Like, yeah. I mean, it's just it, it's just releasing juices, and I think it's good for you. Just you know, clear, get it, get rid of it. Yeah, you know I mean, so it's not something that's nagging in yeah. the back. You know what I mean? Apparently, Ronda Rousey likes to uh, have a bit for, of a for females. A s- it's different. Yeah, she wants yeah. to have like a sex marathon before 
Her fights. Okay. I read somewhere. <laughs> Either that was, or was Dan's <laughs> fantasy. No, no, no. I'm for <laughs> yeah, Gina said Yo, the same thing. I would, I would, <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> Just quickly, Ronda Rousey, this is week number three, but you have not answered any of my requests. <laughs> phone <laughs> calls. 4,000 yeah. now. I have, twi- my, I have my tweeted you. Messages. I have <laughs> tweeted you, and you have not, re- not even a retweet. Ronda, Ronda, I love you. And that is all I got to say about that. Ronda, put me in a Kamora lock with your... Yeah. I'll tell you one thing. I heard <laughs> Ronda, put my dick in a Kamora oh, lock. God. Oh, God. Oh, wow. <laughs> now, but word Mamba. on the streets is uh, the November show. Yeah. We're going to try and get her on the fight in Australia. Oh, really? Wow. Allegedly. You didn't hear that from me. <laughs> wow. if, she, if, she, if she turns up, I'm afraid that Dan's going to commit a crime that day, and he's going to rape her. <laughs> I will not be allowed back into Australia. <laughs> 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 I will probably serve, I will yeah. probably serve some hard time. But oh, with I a I smile on your face, oh, a sm- yeah, hey, hey. <laughs> no doubt, as long as you're happy, no doubt. That's that. that that's that crime you want to commit. But, but that's the thing. Good. I reckon that you would try it on her, and then she would just fuck you up. I reckon, and you wouldn't even get a chance to look her leg. Listen here, listen here. Your teeth will be you, all over. You the floor. underestimate my ability to, to defend myself. <laughs> 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 I think you'd be surprised, bro. Yeah. Yeah. The, the yeah. Yeah. Surprised, bro. <laughs> this you underestimate my weakness. This is also skills. week number wow. two that I've called you out. Wow. So uh, we, we, one thing we've learned today, Dan, is uh, a black belt in rape. <laughs> 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 no, no, I used the belt to tie them up. <laughs> <laughs> black belt. Yeah, wow. Um, uh, and next on UFC. Yep. Yeah, the, you know, com- coming up tomorrow, uh, Monday, New Zealand time, Sunday, uh, Brazil Murray. time. Yep, Frank Mir versus Bigfoot Silver. Battle yep. of the used to be on TRT guys. Oh god, boy! <laughs> <laughs> I want to see what their bodies are going to look like. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, no, actually, I saw the way Yeah, the weigh-ins actually pretty uh, good. Yeah, me looks um, sweet. Uh, you know, Bigfoot always looks a bit awkward. <laughs> yeah, you, you know, you know, the fu- funny thing about Bigfoot is he's got a big head, eh? Yeah, they need really? to call him Big Head. It's, it's, he's, it's, 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 it's not a. Like, yeah, doesn't he have gigantism? Uh, he, uh, he has, he has ugliness. <laughs> That's what he has. No, he looks like you know those those statues that are on Easter Island. Oh, the, 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 the Moai. <laughs> yeah, yeah. That's, uh, he's got a head like that. <laughs> hey, I'm I'm just saying what he looks like. He's a good dude. Obviously, he's a good <laughs> fighter. He's yep. been a champ. Yeah, but he reminds um, me of the great Kali. Just gonna throw that oh, out. Yeah, oh, wow, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Nate, too it's far. It's a chin. <laughs> I agree. Chin. That is Nate Evans. Evans, is that your last name? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, Shit. Bigfoot, though, no doubt. Is an ugly ass motherfucker though. <laughs> you know, Look yeah. At, yeah. He, he, he actually does have gigantic. <laughs> yeah, that, you know what's <laughs> funny is um, Vanderlei Silva. He said that he did fighting because he wanted to get girls. What an ugly so looking So he took his shirt off and he fought dudes. He is such an <laughs> ugly dude. But he's got a beautiful wife and hey, uh, all, all yeah, success yeah, to him. Yeah. You know, you know why? Money. 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 Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Money. I tell you what, man. I could be a rich motherfucker and I would have about seven. Or, I'd be like the new big I'd love be a television too. show. <laughs> you know? yeah, yeah, yeah. So, so break it down for us there. Tomorrow, of course, we got we got uh, Silver versus Mare. I, I'm pretty sure we're on the same page. We're all picking. We're all picking. We're, we're all picking um, uh, Silver. I haven't decided yet. Yeah, yeah well, I, I think if it's, if it stays standing, silver. Yeah, silver is definitely better at standing up. But if it goes to the ground, then Frankie. Yeah. Yeah. Both yeah. of them have Mills a button, though. You know, e- either one of them could be could be taken so out. Because even the whole TRT thing, like um, when he fought Mark Hunt. Yeah. And yes, and, and it was took like punishment. Yeah. took some gangster I mean? shots. Yeah, yeah. yeah. and that, that one was turned into a no uh, no, no, no contest. contest. Yeah, yeah, but yeah. I mean, like Joe's even said, like you know, TRT's effect on the ability for a guy to take shots before. I mean, yes, it's not. I don't know if, if, if there's like some credible science on it or anything like that. Yeah. But you know, there's something to be said for it because when he fought Mark Hunt, he was able to take so many shots. Huge now, shots. Yeah. You know, he fights a guy like who was his last fight? He got knocked out. Um, Travis didn't no, uh, no, uh, uh, Arlovsky. Uh, oh yeah. Yeah, yeah. Nah, right yeah, yeah Arlovsky. You know I mean, that was just like a little bloop, and then yeah, he flopped down. You know, yeah. I mean, things happen. It's heavyweight. You know, they're fucking huge. They're swinging leather. Yeah. But because uh, if you look at Dan Henderson, he you know Same since he came well. off, yep. exactly, yeah, you know what I mean, yeah. So yeah, that's one another one. Those um, asterisks you put by those ones. Yeah. So, so both both fighters are coming off um, multiple losses. So slides. And and I'm counting yeah. and I'm counting the Mark Hunt one as a loss, not a no contest for yeah, sure. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> you know, let's uh, honestly, that, yeah. that's, two how I, judges, that's how I saw it. Two yeah. judges voted for Mark, and then one one judge said, yeah, uh, no, no, sorry, one judge went for Mark, and then the two went for a draw. And and that's then you that's the yeah, yeah, I mean, yeah. I, just, I, th- I, I thought I thought it was just a, I thought it was just plain simple decision that 
one. If, if yeah, just, yeah, yeah. On the fight itself, I give it to Mark. Yeah, yeah, yeah for yeah. sure. Uh, and uh, you know, Silva, as, as all the funny jokes, he does kind of look like those deflated NFL balls <laughs> that Tom Brady was throwing. <laughs> he kind of, he kind of looks like a deflated the, rugby ball. Tom Brady um, has deflated balls. <laughs> <laughs> and goes Frankie Mears come off four losses. Um, yep. But if you have a look at the four losses, you got Dos Santos, yes. DC, Josh High Barnett, level. and Overeem. Yeah. So you're talking about top top guys over yeah. over very divisions too. So yeah, yeah. Um, also a lot of ped use there as well. <laughs> yeah, but, is, but is, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> well, is, just an over him alone. <laughs> is, uh, yeah. Is Frank is Frank Mir long past it though? Nah, I don't think so. I don't want to say so just because it's he's a student of the game and he understands. And it's heavyweight, you know. Frank Frank Mir has before he became very good at jujitsu. You know, he was a kickboxer. Yeah. By by nature, so yeah. yeah. F- f- those guys when they throw and they land. Uh, there's always a chance exactly but um yeah same thing with Frank I just think like he can uh, he can adapt his game better to suit yeah. today's time you know what I mean I don't want to say you know he's past his prime or whatever or he's yeah. left behind still one of the most dangerous heavyweight grapplers exactly. in, the, yeah. in history so. and his stand up's not too bad as well like yeah. UFC 92 when he fought um Nogueira and won the Inter yes. Championship. Yep. That yeah. was some of the best yeah, that was good. stand-up I've seen. Very emotional him. Frank Mir that yeah. night. Yeah. 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 But I mean, his stand-up looked really crisp that night. Yeah. back to whatever he was doing for that fight. Yeah. That yeah. was... That was <laughs> 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 That's the drugs. <laughs> Damn it. Back to it. Full circle. <laughs> <laughs> no, but I mean, I just think even the skill level that night, he looked good on the stand-up. Yeah. But yeah. Like you said, maybe he's, maybe, yo-yoed. maybe he's not able to execute it the way he, he wants yeah. to because of the um, supplements. Yeah, but yeah, that's right. I you know, he's getting know. older. I, I it's a losing battle once really. you're out of your prime, I think. It's, and, you know, and I reckon that um, what the UFC will do is they'll give them both contracts so then they will never be able to fight yeah. give them like an or, eight fight contract or, uh, like each. WSOF yeah. or anything like that, you know? Yeah. They did that with Vanderlei, didn't they? By that mm, legacy, yeah, yeah. yeah. That's what they've done with uh, Anderson, obviously. Yeah, yeah. How many fights did they sign him to? Like 18 or some shit? Yeah, it was a number that he is never going to fulfill. Yeah, he's pretty fucked after failing yeah. that, uh, that drug test. Yeah, though, that's so. right. I still hope he just comes back and does one more fight. Not Weidman, because yeah. I just don't think... Nah. I would like to see him. his last fight against Machida. Yeah? Like, yeah. Machida, Machida versus Machida Silva. Machida's and still in his prime, though. Yeah, Machida's he's he's still, still a contender, yeah, so... so he'd probably smoke him. I don't want to see that. Yeah. <laughs> and, and Machida's uh, has actually come out and said that he's wanted to fight Silva, Silva and Silva's yeah. been yeah. disappointed yeah. at that. Yeah, that must be a burning question for those guys. You know, they've been training together for years and, you know, they've got the Black House history, etc. Yeah. So, you know, surely they, they would want to challenge each other at some point. I'm sure they've seen it in the gym. That's why Anderson probably doesn't want to yeah. fight him. Yeah. I mean, I don't want to say that, but I just think Machida would take that fight yeah. just because of Anderson now. Anderson is prime. I'd give it to Anderson. No yeah, 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 yeah. Anderson right now. I've seen the way. I mean, granted, he came off. You know how many months off as well? Off yeah. injury. Yeah, so yeah. long time. He didn't look his best in that fight, and he yeah. took some shots as well. From he the got tagged but, way yeah. too many yeah. times. But if he'd been hit by like, a real striker. Yeah. Yeah. But I mean, things happen, man. It's the game. Yeah. Even right. even the co-main event now uh, for tomorrow is uh, a good. Ah, fight Barboza. You yeah, just you just right. stole Boza. my flow. Cut his uh, lunch. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Cowboy. Great minds think like my friend. That's <laughs> the one, and we are both great minds, even there if I'm go. better looking. Oh, it's in Barboza. This is the menace, Michael <laughs> Johnson. Yep. Who are you picking in this one, JB? Um. Well. I know Barboza at home is, is cr- incredibly dangerous. Johnson doesn't really have knockout power um, that we've seen in the UFC. The Black Zillion. Mm. Yep. So, um, you know, I, I'm going to go with Edson Barboza. He's so exciting. Huge, huge striker. Reminds me of Izzy. What about you, champ? Uh, I want to say, if I'm being objective, Barboza as well, just because yep. his striking level is a lot yep. higher than yeah. um, Michael Johnson. Shout out to him as well. I'll probably see him this year, hopefully, get to train with those guys. But I saw nice. him... Um, I saw him spar Nikki Holtzkin on um, YouTube just a few weeks, just a week ago. Yeah. A week ago. A week ago. Anyway, but um, yeah, I just uh, seen the way he was um, getting tagged by Nikki and just his, his movement. I just don't think he has. Because he's got a bit of rust as well. He's coming yeah. off a layoff. Yeah, exactly. A yeah. lot of layoff as well. So I just don't think he'll last. I mean, granted, it's MMA. He can go to the ground or whatever. Yeah. But Stand up wise, I think that's what this fight's going to be. Because Johnson is a grinder, yeah. you know. He he, he, he won. Uh, he won tough his season of tough yeah. as a grinder. Actually, well, he no, he like lost in the place, final. Second place. Yeah, yeah that's right. Yeah. Place. I mean, and Barboza, he, he's pretty resilient. Yeah. 
Yep. And I mean, his 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 one loss in the last four, I mean, was against Cowboy. So yeah, that's right. The yeah. real nice jab. Cowboy just oh. dropped him with this jab, had him all over the place, and then finished him on the ground. It was nice. More big talk for you. Is, oh, sorry, you about to say something? I oh, no, no. So, uh, Cowboy, he's got a fight coming up with um. No, yeah. Medo. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I can, I can yeah, never like. pronounce his fucking <laughs> yeah, name. That's right. But the guy is Habib. Habib. Yeah. Medo. <laughs> yeah. You gotta say but it slow. Yeah, yeah. yeah, I, yeah. yeah even if I said it slow, he's, I, he's coming off a yeah. big layoff yeah. as well. Yeah, but um, I think he's going to be the biggest test for Pettis. Yes. Be, um, well, so, so you think he's just going to walk through Cowboy? Yeah, yeah. I, I, yeah. From from what I I've seen, I want to go for Cowboy. Yeah, you wanna, yeah. yeah I want to go for Cowboy. Like you know, one. Cowboy is a is his striking is is what um, uh, Namega Medov's grappling is. You know. Yeah, like yeah, yeah. Sambo, etc. But uh, yeah, see, he'll eliminate that that striking distance, and he'll just yeah. get close. I mean, his style so is getting is suplex. getting up in there. Yeah, and just, yeah, yeah. break him yeah. with like just suplexes and shit. Yeah. And, and if you watch his uh, highlights, he fucks everyone up. Yeah. He he really hasn't been uh, tested by anyone. He hasn't yeah. really been hurt. Yeah. Uh, you yeah. don't really see him struggling in any of his fights. And he, he when he fights, uh, he f- makes them fight his fight. Yeah, at yeah. his pace. At, at his pace and everything. Impose so, your will. That's um, the, you know, yeah, the so I think, he's, I think he's just going to walk through Saron. Yeah. But... Pettis, man, yeah. fuck! I want Pettis to beat him. One thing is, Pettis like, to kick his fucking head off. Pettis, when he <laughs> when, when he fought um Gilbert, he was coming off an injury. He didn't even look like hundred percent the way he yeah. normally yeah. looks. You know what I mean? So I can't wait till he fights. He's gonna cream Dos Anjos. Shout out to him as well. Mm. Yeah, I don't, I, yeah, I don't. I don't see that fight going past the third round. Nah, yeah, especially yeah. coming off an ankle injury for um, half an hour. Dos Anjos as well. He hurt himself. Yeah, yeah, he broke his ankle. I think. Yeah. Shit. Yeah. And, and I mean, Pettis is Pettis is just better at everything. Yeah. Compared to him. Rufus Sport, shout out to Duke yeah. Rufus. Yeah, yeah. Style Where uh, CM Punk cool. has gone, of course. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. CM, yeah. Hey, CM yeah. Punk that was called out by Izzy. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I saw that on Facebook. I was like, oh, man. <laughs> <laughs> that's, that's <amazing. laughs> So a couple of big announcements though throughout the last seven days for UFC events coming up. The first one which impacts us directly. Yeah. Talk about Mark Hunt being called. Yeah. Um, he's going to be taking on Mirchik in uh, at, at, at Adelaide. Yeah, yeah that's right. Back. Yo, big back. deal. Stipe Miocic, um, you know, good striker. Uh, not not anywhere near Mark's level, I would say, but he's definitely a grinder. He's got a collegiate wrestling background, etc. Yeah, from uh, Cleveland, Ohio, as well. And, and his last fight was against um, JDS. Th- yeah, JDS, yep. and he he fucking gave him a he, real yeah, he good stood run. his ground. He's uh, yeah, and I was actually surprised. I thought that he'd try and stay out of range and just kind of yeah. you know keep keep safe, but well, he, he was in there. the pocket with him. He was happy to stand there, down, yep. and um, he really shot. exposed JDS as well. That Fifth yeah. round though was th- th- that was where JDS won it. That's right. Yeah, yeah. yeah. That's where JDS's heart really came out. Moment, you know, whooping. and just man, JDS. I think Kane took life off JDS at least. Shaved, years. yeah. Definitely he right. shaved some Definitely years off yeah, his man. life. But you know, yeah. J- JDS is one of those guys like they, like the, the the champs who know how to fight those championship rounds. You know, yeah, they, been they, there. yeah, that's right. They've been there. They know what to do in the fourth and fifth rounds, and that's what you, yeah. you see the big difference yeah. when they go into these. And I think I think Mark should be okay. Um, oh, I, I think so. Yeah, yeah, yeah. definitely. I think, I think Mark will be okay. I, Stipe I, I has stoppage power. Mm-hmm. Yeah, but I, I can't see him. I don't think he has the power to yeah. stop to Mark. stop Hunter. Yeah, you know. And, and you know, I, yeah, I mean, Mark King has been stopped before. I mean, it is yeah. possible. Yeah, sure. but High level. I don't think. Yeah, I yeah. don't think that this guy is going to be any sort of threat to Mark. Uh, so in, hopefully, in the grappling, grinding. You know, Mark's got impeccable takedown defense. Mm. So that's really where it's going to be. I think decided is against the cage. Yeah. Yeah. And of course, the other big announcement was UFC 187's card. Huge. Shit. Yeah. Massive card headline. Of course, co-main events: John Jones versus Anthony Johnson for the light heavyweight oh, title. Yeah. And then. Chris Weidman and the Vita Belfort the fight that happened the fight that happened yeah, yeah. I need to be there when is that? <laughs> uh, that is going to be on the 23rd of May May yep. live from the MGM Grand Garden Arena it is a massive card if Tra- you Tra- there, uh, Travis Brown versus Alovsky yeah. no but yeah. like I tell you like Rashad me and him talk on, on and off um, yeah. but um, he said yeah, that's Rashad point. Evans yeah oh, Rashad Evans, yeah, yeah. Rashad Evans. Like, shout out to Sugar no Rashad yeah. but yeah he just told me can he hook me up with Ronda? Uh, <laughs> more, importantly, <laughs> more importantly, more uh, importantly, yeah, like, can I get laid? When I when I when I met him, first thing he said to me, he looked at me, he's like, 
Dad, you look like John Jones. Like that's the first thing he said to me. And you I, do I look like, like John Jones. Though. Everyone, Jones looks like me. <laughs> he, just got on TV first. he just got on TV first. <laughs> but um, yeah, he just told me to come through and you know just help out because I've got the same similar body type and uh, yeah, nice. I believe I know my stand up is a lot better than Jones. His wrestling is better than mine. But yeah. stand up wise, I know I cr- well, high I level Muay Thai will trump high level yeah. MMA striking. Exactly. In yeah. Every yeah. Day. And he's learning as well, and he's still doing great with what he's yeah. doing. But yeah. you know, I just want to go over there, Blexillians, and you know just connect just just network with them and learn from guys like Hooft and yeah. spa with yeah Johnson, Henry Hooft you know. what's up yeah. crazy man and yeah, spa see. with Rumble yeah Rumble ah. that's gonna be fun get a bike <laughs> yeah. get a bike helmet for that one bro, bro. I mean like did you <laughs> none of you have answered my question about whether or not he can hook me over Ronda Rousey <laughs> I'll, ask, I'll, 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 I'll ask I'll ask yeah I'm not joking everything's I'm going soundbite jokes right now I'm like <laughs> turn the mic off and talk about this no 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 I'm sorry um That'd be pretty. That'd be pretty massive. You yeah. inspiring with Rumble, badass. Yeah. Like yeah. seriously, yeah, yeah. yeah exactly. Especially even if you could put Rumble on the ground, yeah. if you can yeah. hit him and drop him, nah, take a photo nah. straight away. <laughs> <laughs> take a fucking I'm selfie. About that life. Just be like, I ain't about that life. life, but boom, thug life straight <laughs> up. <laughs> <laughs> My bad. Uh, I don't know what happened. <laughs> this is the kick. Nah, but I mean, like, yeah, for me it'd be good and just connecting with those guys and yeah. Wants to do like the tour of LA as well. I want to check out Timo Yama, where my boy Jamie went to as well. Nice, nice. Cool, Twister, cool. you know, formerly trained at. Yeah. Check out Huntington Beach and all those areas as well. And just, just, yeah. I, I want to see what America's like. I've never been, yeah. so I want to like go down to Muscle Beach, do a, Ooh, do some sit. Ross Coast chicken and waffles, the Holy Grail. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> go to, to the Playboy Mansion. I'll find a way in. Find, yeah. I'll I'm find sure R- Rashad Drive Evans someone. looks yeah. like he's been there before. <laughs> <laughs> Rashad Evans looks John like John's probably been there before. John Jones, yeah, fuck Hey, <laughs> DC ain't you know that, eh? Because <laughs> you guys see the Because he's all about that cake. Yeah, oh, yeah you see that. that. Yeah. That cake. That I thought it was pretty funny, though. It was actually that for, that. Um, funny shit. It was for uh, uh, an award show, apparently. Uh, for real? Yeah, I think it was the MMA Awards. Yeah, yeah. So, okay. Good for him to take have a bit of a laugh at himself, though, you know? I like that, man. If you can laugh at yourself, we can because these yeah because the DC is he, he gets pretty intense in his build up to his fights you know yeah. and so yeah, yeah. for him to be able to, and, and even like sometimes when he's on Fox Sports uh. he sort of comes across a little bit intense as well until he gets a smile on yeah. but leading up to that John Jones fight he was John he, Jones he, he was, yeah, yeah. <laughs> he was pretty in, like, no, no, and, and don't get me wrong I, I know he's a fighter yeah, yeah. so yeah, yeah. I, I, I get that he's intense but I think it was good for him to have a bit of a laugh at himself. You know, yeah. look at the lighter side of DC. And, yeah, uh, yeah. I think it changed a lot of fans' per- uh, yeah. perception too yeah. on, on DC on as well. DC and I think you'll well. find yeah. DC yeah. might good turn into a fan, sure. a real fan favorite now. Yeah. And it's funny because he's like, I mean, he'll never have abs in his life. You know what I mean? Yeah. So he's one of those guys that just. <laughs> yeah, well, like we know that. But, no, but <laughs> we know that feeling. But still, he's one of the baddest dudes on the planet. Yeah. You know oh, I mean? fuck yeah. So that's why I mean, it's just one of the. Like, even me. People just sometimes, a lot of people think I'm like, I don't know, feminine or a little bitch sometimes, but I'm like, fuck you. Which yeah. guys are these? Because <laughs> are they still alive? <laughs> uh, they're around, they're around, everyone. But I mean, it's just once you're confident. I don't think yourself, you're a bitch. Me, yeah. oh, thanks, I'm man. standing too close to you. So <laughs> like, <laughs> you're in striking range. <laughs> I'm, in sh- I'm in striking range. They're just going to grab me, put me in a ring, they can choke out. That's, that's the wrong hand. That's you the wet hand. Oh. You went for the hand. Oh, he goes for the stranger. And we also haven't covered off Cowboy Throne versus. Tell me the pronunciation again, because I never get it right. Well. No yeah, yeah. The the, there know, you go. There you Dagestan, go. Dagestan, what's yeah. up? Yeah. So that's a that's. I mean, that's a big fight too. But who's? I mean, Cowboy's obviously got to have the. I want to go for Cowboy. He's got to have the go on that. Gangster. Man. Uh, Cowboy's the man. Yeah, he is. Ka- uh, Khabib has just been Khabib, on a tear. Khabib, whatever his name is. Khabib. He's been yeah. He's been <laughs> fucking everyone up. Yeah. And, that, wow. and he Back is, off an injury, the, he is the serious. Serious problem for Pettis because he can do what Gilbert couldn't do, yeah. and he can close that mm. distance Take much him faster. Down. Mm. Well, I will, I will say I've gone, I've gone against Cowboy before in the past. Like even the Barbosa fight, I said the same thing. I was like, yeah. Oh, yeah. man, stand up is too good." And neck minute, whoop, that yeah. jab. Yeah, you know what I mean. So I don't want to go against Cowboy. I just I like him too much. He's too cool. Yeah, uh-huh. he seems yeah. like a cool Great guy. Great yeah. I'm fanboying on Cowboy. That's why. <laughs> but if I want to, if I want to bet money, I will bet on Khabib. Yeah, 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 yeah. I think that that's the smart bit. Yeah, smart but the, bets but on the, the hardness goes with you know. I just like saying that name, Khabib. 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 You've, you've also got. <laughs> yeah. You've also got the big Hawaiian Travis Brown taking oh, on oh, Slinky. Andre Alovsky. Oh, Slinky. What the fuck is up with all these hard names to pronounce, man? Okay, <laughs> can we just get some easy names? Travis Brown's a difficult yeah, yeah. one. <laughs> <laughs> Travis Brown's all good, but <laughs> this is <laughs> the sledgehammer. That'll be you know. <laughs> I mean, you're talking about a, you're talking about a guy in the last couple of years has beat an Overeem, um, yeah. uh, and w- went down. Brendan Sharp, uh, yeah. The sh- wow. Yeah. <laughs> okay, can I say something? Like, everyone, shout you out know to how, Big Brown. You know how um Joe like 
you know, and thing um, intervention, in, intervention um, Big Brown. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Talked yeah. about his striking. Same thing right. I see in them. Travis. Only thing I see about Travis is good footwork. He uses his reach well. But yeah. Apart from that, I just don't see a strike in his high level either. Does Trevor? Yeah, does yeah. Trevor's Brown? Can he take Mark Hunt? Nope. Yeah. No, no bro. Out. Mark Hunt's nah. level of striking is, is yeah. you know. And Mark's fought tall guys as yeah. well. He's yeah. in, like, you know, the top percentiles of strikers yeah. in the UFC. I just don't see it happening. Like, I'm not hating on the guy or anything. But yeah. I just feel like some of these guys, like Brennan, for so long, I like Big Brown. But same thing what Joe said. I was just like, man, these guys, their striking is just not all that. Yeah. Yeah, you know, yeah. I'm not going to talk shit because my wrestling is not the best right now. But, or my yeah. grappling. But I think you'd be surprised. Get, uh, I think you'd be surprised. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, sure, yeah. <laughs> but, yeah, I mean, like, um, yeah, some of these guys, like, Kane. Great striker, JDS. You know, yeah, those yeah. are high yeah, level yeah. strikers. Milk yeah. getting better as well. Yeah, yeah. A guy like Travis, Big Brown. Who else? Um, let me heavyweight. I can think of right now off the top. Um, fucking drop a name. Who? You? Uh, yeah, I'm, I'm out. Yeah, that's yeah, that's pretty much the heavyweight. <laughs> <laughs> <There's something laughs> such I mean, a depleted. Not guys, not guys like uh, Overeem, they're great strikers. But there's guys that I just look at them. You know, even heavyweight like a uh, Chris Weidman's getting better. Um, a guy like um, I don't even think Overeem's really. I mean, like a, he's, a he's a not top, the guy top, he was in K1. Yeah, he's not nah, a top yeah, two yeah, striker yeah. anymore. That was the drugs that were really <laughs> <getting> <laughs> <him> through <laughs> all that horse hey, meat, bro. Horse, yeah, yeah. Horse meat. it's a remember different Overeem to be who beat Lesnar. Do you remember when um Overeem fought uh Shogun? Yes, he was the skinny, skinny. Man. Then he I left I like light the way he looked then. then he left and came back like the fucking incredible Hulk. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <it's laughs> you won't like me when I'm angry. <laughs> <laughs> you know, oh, you know I'm comfortable. I'm like, yeah, whatever. This yeah. is the fucking drugs. <laughs> <laughs> you don't get that big that fast. Yeah, 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 yeah. exactly. Actually, you know what I mean? Well, you know, when he fought um, Lesnar talking about that fight, he, I think he had 13 times the natural testosterone oh, level man. <laughs> for, the, for the fight. So, yeah. you know. John Jones versus Rumble Johnson. Pick a winner now, champ. <coughs> <Ooh>. <laughs> <laughs> Smart money's on Jones, but yep. this like Jones always finds a way. That's the thing. Yeah. And yep. he, yeah. same thing. I want. I don't want to like, you know, cause any trouble or anything. But when I look at Rumble, powerful striker, fast, athletic, but just not fluid. The, the technique yeah. is yeah. lacking for sure. Very yeah, stiff. yeah. And Very something, stiff striker. And something was wrong with Gus in their la- in, in their last fight. You know. Yeah, yeah he got yeah. fucked up. Uh, other than, <laughs> other than <laughs> other, other <laughs> he, he ate an uppercut and then things but went down. He didn't. He didn't. He didn't look like the same fighter that fought John Jones. He was looking past Rumble. You know, well, if you look yeah. at his interviews and what he'd been saying coming up. It was a very fight. quick fight too. Yeah. It was a very That's quick thing, fight. Man, he Rumble, didn't like I've heard Rashad say like you know he throws weird combinations. That's one thing I'm I'm interested in finding out. Like yeah. When he says yeah. weird combinations, I want to know what he means because yeah. I want. I just yeah. You, you, you never know until you're in there. You know. Until yeah. Yeah. You're alive with the person. That's what I saw. I mean, yeah, I just I just don't see him beating Jones. I just don't see yeah. it. Jones is a different animal. Yeah. You know? yeah. But I'll, I'll try and help him get there to beat Jones. I, sure? I, I think with, um, with uh, Rumble is that the power that he can generate that's the, in that's his strikes, right and there. that's very yeah. hard to, to, to train against. You know, like, yeah. you can't really train against someone who's a very powerful. Obviously, stay the fuck out of his range yeah, yeah. yeah. don't get hit by him <laughs> yeah. but do you, do you can't really train to block do you think Rumble do you think Rumble's like in that top in that top tier of absolute ultimate strikers though in the UFC at the moment nope striking power striking power no no, no. striking or striking I'm talking yeah. about yeah. all round not nope. because no, I don't no, care no, how powerful yeah. you are if you can't make them connect nope. Yeah. Nope. yeah 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 yeah, you know, they, you and so that's know, my that's my point. That I'm getting yeah, to is that exactly. John Jones is a super intelligent fighter. Yeah. Oh, absolutely, it's incredible. I mean, you, all you got to do is listen to that interview you did after that yes. cocaine thing yeah, to yeah. really understand how intelligent this guy is. Yeah. 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 you know, and and when you watch him, you're right. He finds he always finds a way, yeah. and it's because he's super smart. Yeah, is yeah. he going to be too smart for Rumble? Well, he's a super smart guy, and he's he's from a super smart camp. You yeah. know, uh, yeah, yeah. yeah, good genes as well. If you look yeah. at his brothers, etc. <laughs> of course, yeah, yeah. yeah. You guys hear about that? His brother wants to fight, fight him. Yeah, 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 charity, yeah, yeah. one round charity. I, think, I, I think, think this. I think his brother has this like warp mentality about I kick his ass when I was a kid. So I yeah, yeah, his ass yeah. Now. But yeah. then you never know. Like Jones, by at home, might have this fear of his big yeah. brother. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Every, every fight Always gonna be the little one brother. mental thing. I still think once they get in the cage, he'll rip his brother's head yeah, off. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. He's gonna be like, but he oh, might yeah. whisper something. I'm gonna tell mum. Okay, <laughs> I'll tell mum what you did last week. Then. Don't tell mum. Tell mum about that drug test. When they're in the clinch, when they're in the clinch, yeah. Don't tell mum, man. Yeah, yeah. 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 Chris Weidman versus Vitor Belfort. Oh, another one. Uh, Weidman, man. Ah, uh, yeah. I have to go to Weidman. Weidman's on the tier. Weidman or looking at that guy. Weidman's gonna win or or. He's going to fail his drug test. 
What? And I saw his no, 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 not white oh, man. Oh, Vito. Vito. Yeah, 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 yeah. With a name like Vito. Okay. Hey, come on, guys. Yeah. No, but seriously, like I saw his photo. I'm today. just excited to see Vito fight after he actually watching fighters yeah, for the yeah. last five years. That's right. Yeah. He was looking really good too. From the photos that they were they were released earlier today, I yeah. think yesterday. Yes. Yeah, um, yeah. he's looking really good. He's he's looking Tone like down, almost athletic. TRT. <laughs> minus the minus. Well, the man, when yeah, he was on CRT, that, that. he had that like yeah, yeah. that stretched skin, muscular yeah. look. You know, like now it looks more natural. Yeah. Speaking of guys who don't look natural, have you guys seen the images of Anderson's one of Anderson's head trainers, Anderson Silva's head oh, trainer? Oh, that oh that guy's been around for years. Yeah, though. yeah. Show that guy. What's his name? Uh, old guy. He's like sixty or something. Yeah, yeah. and he's like got the roid gut. He's <laughs> freakishly <laughs> muscular. <laughs> the roid gut. <laughs> the roid gut? Well. Yeah, yeah. Like it's you know, like he's, he's got belly fat with abs. abs. Yeah. yeah. Ah, like, like, like Austin. <laughs> or Chuck Liddell. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Well, those yeah. old school fighters, eh? Yeah. <laughs> But he didn't have roids though. He just had beer. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. beer and a bad attitude. <laughs> <laughs> and last thing I just want to cover off: UFC 184 coming up in, uh, two weekends away. Yep. Mm. Zingano Ronda. or Rousey? Ronda, but I say it goes off five rounds. It's gonna be a good fight. Yeah, man. Yeah. Bad, super fight. Ked Zingano is no joke. Beast, uh, bitch. If you watch bad the bitch. countdown to UFC 184, it's it's hard not to be in Cat's corner. And she's had a, she's oh, had a pretty man. hard uh, year. Right? I have no problem not being in Cat's corner. Oh, <laughs> this guy. Yeah. No one. You want to be the stool that uh, Ronda Rousey sits on? Eh? <laughs> I don't think I don't, I don't know if you guys picked this up, but I'm down to be the submissive. All right. <laughs> <laughs> I'm, right now, in my stage of my life that I'm in, I don't give a <laughs> shit. <laughs> okay, you let it dominate you. That stuff doesn't that doesn't worry me at all. Hey, it's gonna be good. It's gonna be a good one tomorrow. Though. I'm looking forward to just yeah. seeing the rest of the card for me is a little bit like um, underpowered. Yeah, yeah, it's gonna be a lot of yeah, gonna be a lot of ground games. action and things like yeah, that yeah, as well. Yeah, yeah. But definitely, I think that main event is, is definitely gonna be entertaining to watch, and it's gonna be live here at the tap room. Oh well, yeah. Sleep on them. Though. Like well, the things I like about these cards is like. These are guys that are no names, you know. So yeah, yeah. They so go you make for a name. Going for it. Yeah, yeah. yeah. these, yeah. these yeah. are the cards that you yeah. really make a name. Yeah. Oh, the, the good, the entertaining fights. Yeah, yeah. good yeah. women's fight nice. on on the card tomorrow. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Um, hang on. <laughs> <laughs> There's a good <laughs> women's <laughs> fight. Oh, who, who's fighting? Uh, hold on, let me just uh, bring that stat up. Jessica Andrade versus Marion Renault. Yeah, oh. that's all right. Marion Renault. She was a bit of an unknown when she fought her first fight in the UFC, but she um she she looked good. I, I, you know what Ronda Rousey needs to do to get paid more money? Wow, I know. I, I'd pay her money. What? Oh. Sex tape. Oh. She needs to make a sex tape and then she will no. get paid okay, so much. One thing she said about Kim was like, you know, oh, I can never let you know someone like that, you know, be a role model for my sister or whatever. But yeah, yeah. I've seen these new pictures of um, Sports yeah. Illustrated. Yeah, yeah like, and she's naked as well. Yeah, yeah. Like, exactly. It's yeah. Just, hey, 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 hey. There's a difference between <laughs> naked and being, uh, and uh, tasteful and being classy and tasteful. <laughs> she had and a hand bra She's on. an athlete, guys. <laughs> okay. What? You don't like a hand bra? A hand bra is not acceptable. <laughs> I, I go hamburger at kindergartens. Like <laughs> <I'm like, laughs> every time I go to the beach. That image just made me <laughs> made me spew. Uh, hey, um, no, Mayweather Pacquiao. Let's, let's break Fucking it. Fucking Mayweather all day. Yeah. Cha ching with a check. Cut the yeah, check. Yeah, man. <laughs> he, yeah, sixty forty. That's oh. you know he cut the check right. But we, yeah, I, I think unless there is like some, uh, oh, unless they're Mayweather, variable, unless variable. Mayweather has the worst fight in his entire career, Which there is no way in this yeah, world no. that Pacquiao has what it takes to beat Mayweather. Absolutely. Offensively, um, especially not the way that, especially not the way that Mayweather fights on the back foot. Yeah. yeah. But. I, t I just I cannot see anywhere that I I, I actually don't think it's going to go the twelve rounds. Yeah. I think I Ooh. think Mayweather I think oh I think wow. Mayweather might could him. potentially might finish him yeah. right. around about the eight or ninth round. Man, honestly, man, even me and Eugene are talking. We're trying to find tickets, man. They're in the four digit numbers right now. Yo, so it's eight yeah. grand for for bowl tickets. Yeah, so yeah, we're yeah. trying to find tickets, but. I mean, think about it. This guy, he's probably got like this and one more fight or three more fights at the most. Yeah. yeah. If you were around in Tyson's era in the heyday or Ali's era in the yeah, heyday, yeah. and you said like, I went to this fight, I watched that live. You can, you know, people talk about that. You know, that's like a thing. Like yeah, I saw, yeah. I saw Bruce Springs thing, you know, Queen, Michael Jackson. Yeah, yeah. Like, like, yeah, I'd love yeah. to be able to say I was there for the big fight. Fuck yeah. You know what I mean? That, that, is, gangster, the, man. that is probably the biggest fight of our the this century. Generation. This, this yeah. I, I, would, our generation? I would say that this is the biggest fight in professional boxing since Tyson lost the title to Douglas and not because yeah, yeah. of the, the build up of the fight but the, the fact shot. that Tyson lost yeah, to yeah, Douglas right. in the way that he did yeah. because I mean the, if you if boxing for me uh, the purity of the of, of the the in the ring battling yeah. Okay, yeah. and the science behind boxing it's kind of 
not as appreciated as much because of the way that UFC and kickboxing has has really taken over mainstream. But also because the titles, the titles left America, and America stopped caring. Yeah, sure. they, it was their, we don't their have champion. A champion anymore. Yeah, yeah, they, no. they got all salty. America, but then uh, sons, you know, Deontay Wilder, Wilder. he wins, yeah. and Yo, it's like I'll tell you, know, you one thing, the second man. coming. Because all I saw of him was just highlights, and his highlights, he's just like. Bah, 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 haymakering dudes. Yeah. I was just like, I don't like this guy. He, but I watched that fight of him, his last fight with um, Burn, Burn and, um, what's his name? Uh, we always struggle with his yeah, 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 yeah. His jab, his, his one and two is basic butter, but is golden. It's genius. Yeah, yeah. It's perfect, man. And, and that's so the thing. I'm a like, fan now. I'm a v- fan of Very the basic fighter. He's not throwing out gang, you know, yeah. like Crazy. difficult combos. Yeah. But his one too is it's just it's stopping it's everything. Yeah. Man. And that's why I'm interested to see what happens with Joseph Parker and, and, and yeah. the Super 8 card because I think that's another guy if, I like. if Joseph Parker, well, for me, like I, I, I like the guy. I think he seems like a good, a good wholesome Kiwi kid. Nice, cool guy. Yeah, but if he doesn't show to me in this fight that he's developed more offensively, mm. then I'm going to start really questioning whether or not he's ever going to be able to fight at that level. Yeah, yeah you know, yeah. because. Don't get me wrong. One of the big discussions we've been talking about is the is the media build up and the hype, which the New Zealand media yeah. they've done it to Stephen Adams, yeah. did, you know, and they're doing it to Joe, to Joe Parker. Mm. And and I don't. I, I want to see Joe Parker fight for the title. I want to see him fight for the money yeah. and get that money and set himself up for life and his family Have and to. things like that. Have to. But if I'm watching his development, I haven't seen too much development beyond. Um, uh, where that he was three fights ago, you know, yeah. and beyond that, beyond that, that stick, you know, yeah. and but and how old is Joseph Parker though? though he's young, no, no doubt. He's no got twenty-two. Oh. Yeah. You should be able to see that springboard though. You yeah, know, I mean, when like someone bounces back from all the you know the, the, these champs are like in their thirties. After uh, you know, uh, 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 older dudes, you know, they're winning titles. But how long have they been at the top of their game for? I mean, the Klitschko's have been at the top of that game for what forty Forever. years, yeah, yeah. <laughs> you know. And so you're talking about guys that they're in their, they're in their well. 40s. But yeah. you're talking they're in their mid 20s when they mid to late 20s when they were, when they were, when they were assessing the world yeah. beginning yeah. to. Yeah. And you look at Tyson. Tyson was what 18 years old, and you know, and, and, and for me, those mm. top tier boxers, yeah. the great boxers, are the guys that don't take as long. I mean, okay, so Joe Parker like might develop. He might. John de- Jones. He's yeah. 26. 27, you know? Yeah, and he's been on top of the game Actually, for like three years. Look, you want to talk about another Jones? Yeah. Talk about Roy Jones Jr. My Roy, man. Roy yeah, Jones yeah. Jr. is another example of a yeah, fighter yeah. Who, who at a very young age had developed to be a great fighter. You know, probably the best pound-for-pound pound fighter in the world at, at that time before yeah. I think Floyd really... Agree. Took the science to the next yeah. level. Agreed. Yeah. So for me, with Joe Parker, I'm like, man, I want to see, I want to see Joe Parker do well, but I want to see him develop. I want to yeah. see his skill sets develop. And even though this guy's a bit of the guy he's fighting is, is a little bit of a um a journeyman. Yeah. Jobber. He's, he, yeah. Well, he, I, 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 not, what's his he, record like? His, I heard I, this guy's legit. Yeah. No, I'll bring up his record because I don't think he's exactly a jobber. Yeah. But he um, I don't. Know, let me let me bring this up. But he, yeah. I want to see Joseph Parker actually be put to the test a little bit. Yeah. Have have a really really competitive fight, but also still because you can see a fight you know man you see a yeah, fighter fight you, you know his skill set when you're watching him you know uh, yeah, yeah. you know and it seems like to me joe parker hasn't been necessarily fighting um it's good like one thing i love like that stick like you said that jab is yeah. his money shot man and i try i've even copied it you know like he and deontay wilder right now i'm looking at their jazz and i'm like that's the money like the way they throw it yeah you yeah know, but but you don't like about deontay wilder though what? Is that when he's throwing those overhand rights and those and those body shots, yeah. he's he's delivering it with explosive Everything. power. Yeah, 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 it's yeah. Unreal. And you were the one that actually opened my eyes up, Etty, to this when we were watching because I hadn't seen too much of Deontay Wilder. Yeah. And but when I saw um, the, tra- the 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 the, pre- the promo video for the for the card, and I was watching his build up and his training and his work on the bags, yeah. and mm. then when I saw him actually in the fight against a really solid heavyweight fighter, yeah, yeah, yeah he yeah. was hurting him. And and I haven't seen anything like that out of a fight of its fought Joseph Parker, yeah. or Joseph Parker inflict that sort of punishment on, on other guys. So, yeah. I mean, for me, I want to see Joseph Parker develop test a skill it. set. You want to see him tested. Yeah, and I also want to see his body yeah. develop too because yeah. I think as a heavyweight fighter, yeah. I don't know if he's quite got the... Um, I, I worry that his body's a bit soft to protect yeah. what, what's going on inside there. I uh, think it's all genetic. Like I said about DC earlier on, He's never going to have abs in his life. But, yeah, but yeah. DC looks. But DC still got a big chest. He's yeah. quite solid. You know, yeah, you see, yeah. he's quite solid. Joseph um, looks soft. Joseph, I know what Joseph you mean. Pa- Joe like Parker looks like, like that typical Cain Velasquez. Yeah, a little Same bit like Cain like Velasquez. He's got a soft. Joe body Parker's soft got body. that. He's got that yeah. Islander body. Yeah. You know, but unless you like, let's take a look, uh, just purely for body wise, you look yeah. like the Rock. The Rock. <laughs> and, the Rock in his <laughs> first. Uh, <laughs> Pit pisses in this cup. He'll yeah, yeah, yeah. He'll burn holes through the body. But you look at a guy like him in the first five years of his professional wrestling career. He had that really typical Islander physique. Then he went away and got. 
got that liposuction on his titties. Oh, and wow. then yeah, man, yeah. <laughs> and then but had but he, he did quite a lot of good body work and stuff. And so he, it looked like he he had a type of body. And that's what I want to see yeah. from Joe Parker because I think yeah. much like a rugby player, if a, if a player can't protect his body with his own hands and stuff, mm-hmm. then he needs his body to help do that for him as well. Why wrestlers are so muscly, right? You know, and you know combat athletes. Oh, so it's about taking knocks and things like yeah, that. Eh? Exactly. Taking bumps. Yeah. Well, that's what then I mean. Like never let the body fool fool the skills or the game. You know what I mean? Because guys, you know, even if if guys got a soft body, he might have a strong core underneath it. Yeah. Some yeah. guys just have like everybody's different. You know, some guys might have like better, or I say more fat receptors or whatever. You know. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Like me, I eat and I sleep it off. But like guy like yeah. my mate Diamond, my Morton. Fuck you, bastard. Sorry, I'm. Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> like Fuck Diamond. you and your good fucking <laughs> <laughs> survival so genes, bro. Yeah, so Jake like Diamond, God, it, God damn it. it so Diamond ch- eats, eats. He like gets. Chunky, real yeah. quick. Oh, know? right. So, yeah, you can't. No, he doesn't do it like so that. So, Jason yeah. Petaway's record is 17 uh, wins, 10 by KO, 1 loss by KO. Ooh. So, it's a, it's a, it's a pretty it's reasonable, nice. it's a good record. Yeah. And I think it's a good challenge for Joe Parker. Yeah. But I want to see Joe Parker, like, do, do to these guys what he's done to the, the jobbers before. Yeah. Yeah, um, yeah, yeah, definitely. You know? So, if he does that to this guy, then, I, then he starts to go, all right. That's right. Yeah. But if I'm watching, yeah. if I see the fight go 10 rounds, yeah. and I'm pretty sure it's a 10 round fight, if I see the fight go 10 rounds, yeah, I, I look at Joe Parker. I'm like, you're a heavyweight fighter contending in a heavyweight division. You can't be winning on points. No, that's right. You, yeah, you, yeah, you know, none of these great heavyweight fighters were getting up there. David Tua, yeah. he didn't win. He didn't win. Yeah. I think yeah. he didn't go. He didn't, he, go, he didn't yeah. go. twelve rounds or ten rounds until like Lewis? his his, his, no, his but, first but, loss. Yeah, it was his first yeah. loss was a uh, twelve round. Um, and it made it was that the, the jo- top was that the John Ruiz? No, no, no. It was that guy from um, Africa? So, somewhere in Africa. I think Nigeria. I think Nigeria. No, Friday, I don't know. Friday? No, uh, no, would, no the, the, yeah, yeah. it was early in his career, but he oh, went. Okay. It was actually um, the most punches thrown in a heavyweight uh, fight. Oh, I've heard of this fight. Yeah, 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 it was a real good fight. But yeah, David Tour, he he was waiting for that big hook. Yeah, you know, See? And, and that's been his whole career, you know. Yeah, so he's, he's, he's fallen in love with the power. Short, you yeah. Know? yeah, but he, so I mean, he took he, some gangster hits though. And you look at Joe Park. I want to see Joe Park needs to start finishing dudes, man. Yeah, he's yeah, got, he's yeah. got to start getting some finishes. It happened, like you say, he's young. Like for me, okay, example, when I um, I was around like say 16, 17, not even that, twenty five fights. People were like, oh well, he doesn't really have much knockout power. He's got five, six knockouts out of twenty six fights. And I'm just like, for me, I was frustrated because I knew what I could do. Yeah, yeah. You know what I mean, like every like, if people say, oh, he doesn't hit hard. Really? Stand there and let me punch you in the face. Yeah, yeah. See, exactly. You know. What I mean? Yeah, yeah, Now yeah. I'm at 20 knockouts. People can't say shit. I, I think yeah. the thing. That, I think the big difference for me when you compare the two, the two like Muay Thai and and boxing is you got a lot more tools to work with. You know. Yeah. yeah. Well, it took me a while though. It took me a while. Like from once I went to China, I kind of realized something called knees. And I was like, oh. Yeah. These things, yeah, <laughs> they're quite hard. <laughs> <laughs> if I bounce someone's face off him, <laughs> holy shit! So yeah, like like you said, more tools, but also just learning my body more. Like, like I that realization, yeah, like exactly. self-awareness exactly. of self-awareness, your skills. Being, yeah, yep. my man. The super I'm saying, the super saying uh, training that you yeah. did, because you came yeah. back like a bad motherfucker. Yeah, yeah. you were you were you were, you were good when hey, you went. I'll tell you one thing, yeah. you on came the right back. Track now, man. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Shout out to my mate Davo. Davo's picking up. He's picking up the. Too, yeah, isn't yeah, 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 yeah. 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 Good like, man. To and women, by the looks of it. Wow! But he was always a gentleman. He was always a smooth. Yeah. Yeah. He I was a so much respect. Dava, Dava's yeah. a stand-up guy, man. Yeah. yeah. Like me and Dava, I, I, this is what they call us in the street: Drake type niggas, because we're soft. You know what I mean? We're too like I don't know. I don't say lovey dovey because I'm hard as fuck still, bro. But still. <laughs> Actually, you know what's funny? I, I, we were at a club once, and this girl came up to him and was like, "You look like Drake." <laughs> to Davo, oh, wow. and Davo was like, "No, oh, <laughs> so you need to go home, dude. <laughs> <laughs> Just hold on, you're going home." Yeah, I was like, "Davo, you're in." Davo busting out on this one. Yeah, man. Yeah. Uh, but um, yeah, he's doing well. So uh, hopefully, when he comes back as well, he's super saiyan mode as well. Yeah, 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 yeah. At first, he went there, and you know, I'll be honest about it because he's my boy. But he was, he was lazy. He didn't put the work in, and yeah, yeah. now he got this chick or whatever. But yeah. I mean, now he's, he's he's picking up. You know, he's picking up the work ethic, and yeah, yeah. He come back with you know. He looks like a killer now, eh? He looks yeah. like yeah. a uh, actually. The, 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 goatee, the, yeah, the, goatee, yeah, yeah. the physique now. He looked, yeah. Yeah. yeah, he's just missing some gold chains and oh. some tattoos well, hey, and guns. Got he's, got, he's got, oh, okay. got a gold chain. Oh, wow. <laughs> Drug test. <laughs> Drug t- <laughs> hey, yeah. Sneak something for me, son. <laughs> just joking, surveillance. Oh, so, just joking. I'm not. <laughs>
Egg, <laughs> allegedly. <laughs> what's these, what's, so what's what's up next? Uh, brown butter bean. Brown butter bean. What, what's he got? Butter bean. He's yeah, got, he's yeah, got, yeah, he's got like maca. Like yeah, I like his personality. I like, I like yeah. triple B. Yeah, I like, he, I like the persona. Well, triple at, B. I like it. Yeah, you know, at first I didn't like it, but then. Uh, I got to Then he uh, added you on Facebook Now your buddies uh, eh? <laughs> <laughs> No I mean But then I got to Kind of look at the character And then look at the actual person yeah, yeah, And yeah. to be honest You know He's made Boxing kind of relevant again yeah. uh, And uh, A lot of Real boxers And, and I who, who did you want to see him fight though Did you want to see him fight Freno Marker Or did you want to see him fight I Jeremiah see him fight, like, Or did you want to see him fight Deech Oh, I'll see if I see oh, Sorry, Tony. Wow. Sorry, sorry. Wow. Uh, sorry actually, Deech. no, no. Actually, Deech. Jeremiah. Because I know Jeremiah. Um, I went to school with Jeremiah. Yeah, he, he's he's a bad motherfucker too. He he's the, he won. I think he's had a few cage fights as well, and he was a doorman as well. So I've yeah. seen him scrap, and he can he can throw down. Oldest son of Peter Fats. Yeah, yeah. yeah. But, I, um, I mean, Sonny yeah. Bill, Sonny Bill. Sonny Bill. Bill. That, yeah. That's yeah. what I was talking that's about. You know, yeah. he should fight Sonny Bill and. Can't, I be know. Called, can't be on the corporate rules though, man. You yeah, know? I mean, yeah, yeah. yeah well, he must be due to go pro soon. Yeah, because I mean, he needs to go pro because how many corporates can you? How have? many? Well, I mean, how many people are you gonna call out that uh, until people really stop caring? Yeah, yeah. It's 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 this thing, you and know. Calling out Ed from Henderson. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> who, who the fuck is Ed from Henderson? Yeah, you know, he's getting some funny <laughs> ass dudes. I like the fun, but there's a lot of there's, there's, lot, of, there's a lot of funny, funny ass guys. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 And yeah. yeah, some of them are taking the piss, but some of them are real as fuck. Yeah. Eh? they're like, yeah, yeah, they're yeah. like. <laughs> like, I'm gonna go and kill you, but a pinch, but a pinch. I'm calling you out. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I mean, it's, it's good. It's good because it's making boxing fun again. Yeah. It's making yeah. it People relevant, man. Making it relevant. Yeah. You know, even I was, on, I was on the other side of the fence because I was like, this is before where I got to where I am. I'm looking at this guy. And I'm like, who's this fat fuck fucking yeah, yeah. coming yeah. here doing? You know, yeah, yeah. he just. Like same thing with Sonny Bill when he came on the scene as well. I was like, this, this guy has a pretty, pretty boy. Sort of exactly. thing. He didn't, yeah, he didn't yeah. earn his stripes. I didn't yeah. feel like. I mean, but like I said, with the Super Eight, they look at me that way as well. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. yeah exactly. well, I've got combat sport experience. That's yeah, different. That's right. You know yeah. what I mean, he brings you know the whole rugby, whatever, or, and what being. Yeah. I wasn't sure what he brought, so I was like, who's this dude? And they were talking about 15k, you know. Yeah, no, yeah, yeah, yeah. And actually, yeah. one time when I saw him fight at um at West the Stadium Trust Stadium, did you call him out? No, he was walking out with his belt, and I was like, hey, my man, I want to get that 15k, you know, and he's like bro you can get it man i was like yeah. all right let's see let's see but they never make that far happen but I've, I've talked to him at the mma expo and he's like soft-spoken he's yeah, he's yeah. A nice, dude, hey. nice guy, he's a good guy. Like and as a telly is a great guy and as a yeah. promotional tool he's hanging around with the right guys like yeah, yeah. Hanging around yeah, guys like, DJ, like yeah. also like, like guys that? like rims and stuff he's got guys who've got big following in that polynesian, polynesian market yeah, too. yeah so yeah. people are really through like the, the training he's doing with him and that yeah, and yeah. the build-up they're getting oh. man you know and it's, and it's he's got the right people around he's him. doing a lot of uh positive things as well yeah people are hating on him just to, for the sake of hating on like, him but that's hate. that's the hate achievement like that's exactly what he wants you know he is the heel when he's brown butter bean and yeah. when he's dave he is actually you know that guy cool now he plays the game well you know what i mean yeah and i'm sure when it comes down to it in the streets he can throw down as well oh, hey no, boys yeah. uh-huh. that's all the time we got for tonight no. today no is he <laughs> oh. the man oh. straight up You're fucking knees nah. of fury knees yeah, yeah. the knees of fury king of last the style bending ring. King of the oh, Rings, no. soon to be Super number eight? one of the eight. Hold up, I gotta, oh, I gotta put this picture up, man. But I, like, my friend tagged me in a photo. He caught me at the gym looking at. I got diamonds belt as well, and I put it on the other shoulder. Yeah. I was just looking at it. I was just like, man, this feels nice. I just, I was standing there for the two feet. belts. Yeah, 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 yeah. I, yeah, I saw that. I was just like, no. Nah, and he just caught me. I was like, fuck, this is just. It felt right. So I can't yeah. wait. April 11th, but before that, March 28th, Super Eight goes down. I smell blood. I go for the kill. Yeah, Thank yeah. You. And we're behind you, man. Good luck for there, brother. Oh, that's, that's the right hand, hand again. The same, same hand, hand again. Same oh. hand. God damn. Oh. Still smells like cinnamon. <laughs> cinnamon. cinnamon. She cinnamon works the late mind. shift at Sugars. <laughs> <laughs> Ritz Scarf, you're the man. Summer, man. Thank you very much, brother. Thanks for having me on, guys. I appreciate hey, it. Hey, no worries, man. Any closing statements, Ritz Scarf? Uh, closing Another statements. Right yeah. <laughs> <laughs> um, but closing statement. Change your motherfucking lives. <laughs> it's Sunday. Apart from that, Keep sunning, keep winning, and yeah, see you guys next week. JV, beat oh, yes. So uh, yeah, big shout out to everyone on the Twitter and the Facebook. Don't forget, guys, you can catch us on Stitcher if you're an Android fan, yeah. iTunes if you're an Apple dude, and um, Player FM. But yeah, just and on YouTube, out. right? Yeah, absolutely on yeah, YouTube. We got our own channel, so we got we got it sussed. Soon we're going to have Pornhub. Oh, that's God what's one. up, Not Coolio. <laughs> it's my one. Nate, the white guy. Anything you want to end up with? This is cute. Stats. Pacquiao in three.
Oh, my man. Oh, no, we got my man. Oh, wow, well, what? <laughs> my man. Can what? someone punch him in the face right now for me? Pacquiao in three, fucking seven years hell. ago. You fucking oh, disgust man. me. That's all I want to say Pacquiao about that. Pacquiao goes down in three? <laughs> That's all. That is all oh, I have point. to say. Don't you. show your core strength by yeah, standing on that. <laughs> Ain't nobody got time to see you like dangling like that. Yo, Sports Fan Network, this is Sport and Broad. Catch you next Sunday. We're going to be talking some more UFC for the Ultimate UFC MMA podcast here in New Zealand. Yo, we will see you next week. This is Lupe Fiesco right here on SFN.